For decades, the Lakeview restaurant in Toronto's West End has been a reliable community hub. Thank you. One order at a time. It's been 24 hours a day for 15 years straight, so this place has gone to war many times. After renovations, the iconic diner has reopened with a revamped menu offering both new dishes as well as updated versions of your favorites. We've got the uh, smoked salmon platters. Brunchers can now choose from smoked meats and brisket too. The uh, yogurt and granola is one of my favorite items. It comes with a seared grapefruit that we soak in vanilla syrup and then we torch it like a creme brulee. That's really good. New head chef Adam Zimmerman also leveled up the dinner game. A lot of people, when they want to go for dinner, they're like, where should we go? They had many more options on Ossington or Queen or Dundas. Our idea was, let's make dinner a little bit more exciting. He hopes the reimagined fair will turn around, declining dinnertime sales. You can't have a business open 24 hours and then not, people not coming for half the day. There are about 34% of restaurants in Ontario that are actually operating right now at a loss. Restaurants Canada says across the board, operating costs are rising faster than revenues. Everybody who's been to the grocery store sees that the costs of food are increasing. Are people being priced out of diners? You have to kind of tweak things, bring experiences in. But res restaurants aren't actually passing on the whole costs to customers. They're very conscious that consumers are also feeling pinched. So what's the appetite for whitefish terrine, beef tartare and Miami ribs at the Lakeview? Everything is approachable and you can't really say anything until you try it. The last time the diner elevated its plates was when Fadi Hakim took over the space 15 years ago. They added dill to the tuna salad and apple pie to the milkshakes. We did eggs Benny, which was, again, never a diner thing. So funny thing is, is that there were a lot of people that were saying, oh, the diner is dead. Now? Getting steak and seafood in is kind of just kind of a nice, nice addition to, to uh, you know, the tapestry of, of Trinity Bellwoods. And yes, those apple pie milkshakes are coming back. For City News, I'm Karen Seolin.